Hi, hello, this is Naresh. Welcome to Naresh Designs. Uh, today I'm going to teach you eyedropper tool. How to use eyedropper tool and uh, one more tool, color sample tool. Okay, shortcut key is I. Now, I want to change my workspace area. It's looking like palettes here and everything, right? First, I'm going to change my own thing. Go to Windows. You want to change your work area. There is a different options. Essentials, new in C6. Now I'm using new in C6 painting and photography and everything is here uh, one keep essentials like this will come and uh, I just uh, created one my new workspace Naresh okay you want to create you just create it now I'm going to use eyedropper tool okay eyedropper tool uses means like when you painting purpose and uh, add design stamp and uh, app design stamp the time easily to selecting the colors and foreground colors and background colors it will help out okay now I'll show you this see here is the foreground color is red and black, background color is black and foreground color when you want to click just here the color is changing you observe it okay and uh, you want to change background color same thing using like uh, eyedropper tool just hold on the alt in keyboard okay just click it see the background color is changing okay see here like this okay it's changing right so this is nice and uh, one more thing I'm going to tell you here eyedropper tool like uh, in option toolbar there's a sample size and sample okay uh, sample size means like a point sample by 3 by 3 average, 5 by 5 average, 11 by 11 average, 31 by 31 average. Just 3 by 3, just select it. Just click it. Okay. It's RGB colors. Okay. It will take 3 by 3, like 4 by 3, whenever you want to keep it. Find sample, we'll just keep it. Find sample, wherever you click, that color only is selected there. Okay. The same thing, sample. Okay. Here, the default is all layers is there, and current layer, now it's current layer, current below and and all layers, all layers, no adjustments, current and below, no adjustments, okay, we'll keep all layers, because uh, I'm having only one layer here, okay, <coughs> uh, whenever you have two, three layers, at any time you want to use the color, okay, that time just current and below layer, just keep it current and below, and you can use it, I have only the foreground, background, only one image, okay, and the next thing, we're going to color sampler tool, okay, just click it, color sampler tool, there is a different options you want to see its info okay I'll show you first thing this one okay I drop a tool just you're clicking here the RGB levels are changing here okay RGB and CMYK okay that's what the same thing you just click it color sampler tool click here one and two three and four the sampler tool means selected by four things okay see here uh, rgb colors here yeah, changing rgb and cma colors one uh one two three four four samples are here one two three and four here different rgb different thing uh, uh rgb levels and uh, here is different rgb levels third one also different rgb levels are here okay uh, the same thing you want to just move it here just move it wherever you want to take okay just move it here like this okay and uh, just click the alt and click it here you don't want the sample just delete it okay you want otherwise you want it just add it again okay and you take uh, eyedropper tool here just alt and click it okay these two why because we use like uh, when you want to change like uh, background color like foreground color uh, like Im images and uh, any design thing purpose and painting purpose okay it will use for eyedropper tool and color sampler tool i hope you guys are understanding this class thank you for watching